Hi everyone, welcome to Notes Craft. Today's exploration takes us into the captivating world of H.G. Wells' timeless classic, The Time Machine. H.G. Wells, a master storyteller and a pioneer of the science fiction genre, invites us to question the very fabric of space and time. His innovative ideas articulated in this groundbreaking novel have left an indelible mark on literature and sparked countless adaptations and discussions. Our journey begins with Wells' novel, The Time Machine a narrative that transcends the boundaries of time. It introduces us to an unnamed protagonist, a Victorian English scientist and gentleman inventor living in Richmond, Surrey, who uses his inventive prowess to explore unforeseen eras. This concept of time travel, the ability to move forward and backward through epics, is the lifeblood of the novel, setting the stage for a tale that is as thought-provoking as it is thrilling. Now that we've set the stage, journey with us as we delve into the intricate plot of this revolutionary novel. The Time Machine begins with our unnamed protagonist, often referred to as the Time Traveler, sharing his fascinating invention with his skeptical friends. Gathered around a table, the Time Traveler astounds his guests by presenting a miniature model of his creation, a machine capable of traveling through time. He explains his theory that time is a fourth dimension, just as real and tangible as the three dimensions of space we're all familiar with. His friends, while intrigued, struggle to fully grasp this revolutionary concept. Undeterred by their skepticism, the time traveler ventures into his workshop. He returns not with another model, but with the actual time machine. This full-size device, a marvel of Victorian engineering, is poised to carry him into the uncharted waters of time. With a mix of fear and exhilaration, the time traveler takes a seat, adjusts the levers and embarks on his maiden voyage into the future. As time whizzes by, he watches the world outside change at an astounding pace. Sunrises and sunsets become a blur, and buildings rise and fall in the blink of an eye. He finally comes to a halt in the distant future, in the year 802,701. Here, he finds a seemingly utopian society, populated by the Eloi, small, delicate beings who lead a life of leisure in a world where all their needs are taken care of. They live in harmony with nature, in a world that appears to be free of struggle and conflict. However, the time traveler soon realizes that this future society is not as perfect as it first appeared. He notices that the Eloi lack curiosity and intellect, seemingly having lost the need for thought and innovation. The time traveler is both fascinated and disturbed by this, pondering the implications for humanity's future. His first encounter with the future might seem idyllic but our time traveler is about to discover a darker side. As the time traveler ventures further he stumbles upon a sinister secret lurking beneath the surface. Venturing into the depths of this unfamiliar world our protagonist encounters a new species known as the Morlocks. Unlike the Eloi, the Morlocks are grotesque blue-skinned beings who dwell underground, shunning the light of day. Their subterranean lifestyle and their predatory nature hint at a darker reality of this utopian future. The time traveler soon uncovers the harsh truth of this seemingly idyllic world. The Eloi and the Morlocks represent a society divided, not by wealth or status, but by the labor they perform. The Eloi, living a life of leisure above ground, are in fact the livestock, while the Morlocks, toiling away in the darkness, are the providers and the predators. This shocking revelation triggers an intense struggle for survival, as the time traveler finds himself hunted by the Morlocks. His time machine, his only means of escape, is stolen, leaving him stranded in this dystopian future. With the Eloi unable to aid him he must rely on his wits and courage to recover his machine. In his quest, the time traveler experiences firsthand, the brutal reality of the Morlocks' world. He witnesses their savage nature, their disregard for the Eloi's lives, and the stark contrast to the peaceful existence above ground. These encounters serve as a grim reminder of the potential consequences of societal division and exploitation. As the time traveler fights for his survival, he also witnesses moments of kindness and bravery among the Eloi, particularly from Weena, an Eloi woman who befriends him. Her sacrifice during a confrontation with the Morlocks highlights the capacity for courage and selflessness in even the most oppressed societies. Finally, after a harrowing encounter with the Morlocks in their subterranean realm, the Time Traveler manages to reclaim his machine. He narrowly escapes the future, leaving behind the Eloi, the Morlocks and a world that has given him a profound understanding of the potential pitfalls of societal evolution. With his machine finally reclaimed, the Time Traveler escapes the grasp of the future, but his adventures are far from over. Returning home, the Time Traveler is not the same man. 
his experiences have changed him profoundly. He arrives back in his own time, wearied and disheveled, with a tale that is almost too fantastic to believe. To his assembled friends he recounts his incredible journey through time, his encounters with the Eloi and the Morlocks, and his chilling visions of the Earth's distant future. For some his story is too fantastic, too far beyond the realms of possibility, they question his sanity, his honesty. But others, perhaps those who know him best, see the changes in him, the haunted look in his eyes, the weight of his experiences etched into his very being, and they begin to believe. The time traveler however is not seeking validation or acceptance. He shares his story as a warning, a cautionary tale of a world that could be, if humanity continues down its current path. And then, just as mysteriously as he returned, the time traveler disappears. His time machine is gone, and with it, any proof of his extraordinary journey. His friends are left to wonder, to speculate. Did he go back to the future? Did he journey to another time entirely? Or did he simply vanish, consumed by his own invention? His housekeeper, the only witness to his final departure, finds a small, strange flower on the floor of the time machine's workshop. It's a flower she has never seen before, a flower from another time, another place. It's a small piece of undeniable proof that the time traveler's journey was real, that his tales of the future were true. The time traveler's story leaves us with a sense of wonder, a sense of fear, and a sense of hope. It forces us to question our own place in time, our own future, and the path that we, as a society, are choosing to follow. And so, our journey with the time traveler ends, leaving us with more questions than answers. It's a journey that challenges us, that pushes us to think beyond our own time, our own experiences. It's a journey that once begun, can never be forgotten. The time machine is more than just a thrilling adventure through time. It's a thought-provoking commentary on society and human nature. This literary gem by H.G. Wells is steeped in profound themes that continue to resonate with readers even today. Thank you for watching. Please like and share our video and subscribe to our YouTube channel. If you enjoyed our content, let us know what you want to see next in the comments down below.